And uh, to celebrate, I think we got an amazing show tonight. We're going to do something. People love this. It's the writer's favorite. It's called If They Made It. Let me explain how it works. They just love it, those writers. And here's how it works, all right? Let me explain how it works. We have an amazing machine here. It was built by NASA in the late 80s, early 90s. We bought it for like $600. This machine takes celebrity couples that are in the news, that are sort of having a romance, that have been, uh, they're in the tabloids for getting, getting together, and we find out what would happen if those two celebrities had a child, what would that child look like? It's very accurate, very hurtful, and we love doing it. So we're gonna do that tonight. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's never, it's been proven right every single time. And we'll, you'll see as we go along what's going on here. For example, Nicole Kidman has been seen with country singer Keith Urban. <laughs> there he is. There he is, just out of the shower. And uh... anyway, these two apparently are going out, Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban, and our machine is going to tell us what would happen if they had a child, exactly what it would look like. Let's take a look right now. I'm just curious. And oh! it's kind of David Spade, a little bit. A little bit of David Spade. I can't tell. All right, well, uh, you'll see. These are, again, very accurate. Eva Longoria, one of the sexiest women alive, and Tommy Lee. Now, this is true. I think I saw this all go down. Not the whole deal, but uh, <laughs> I didn't watch that. <laughs> but I'd like to. Um, <laughs> the tabloids say that they hooked up. They were both on our show. Remember this, Max? Like a month or so ago? Mm -hmm. Uh, they, they both hooked up on our show, and, uh, and the tabloids say that they're together now. Uh, what would happen if these two had a child? What would it look like? Let's see right now. I'm just curious. And oh. It's, it's Steven Tyler from Aerosmith. Isn't it? Sort of? I think, yeah. Very pretty man. This is uh, Eddie Murphy is newly single, and he's been seen canoodling with Mariah Carey. Did you know that? <laughs> what? They're both very attractive people. What do you... This is... I'm sure this is going to be a very good-looking child. Why? This audience so suspicious of anything I do. So convinced. Eddie Murphy, Mariah Carey. Let's see what that child's going to look like. I'm convinced. Let's go. And then... Oh, no! child has a weak eye. A... <laughs> Look at that. It's, it's coming on to me. I don't know. This is interesting. Uh, uh, these two were once, uh, they were once co-stars. Uh, now they're romantically linked. Believe it or not, Diane Keaton and Keanu Reeves. <laughs> Diane Keaton. There's, <laughs> there's Keanu Reeves. He's daring me, like, dude, go ahead. <laughs> I'll kill you. Uh, Diane Keaton, Keanu Reeves, let's just see what would happen if they had a child. I have to find out. And oh! <laughs> oh my God. Who is that? <laughs> it's one of the film buffs up in the audience. <laughs> Show the face, I'll do the voice. How dare you, Conan O'Brien? <laughs> How dare you demean Star Wars? These are my film glasses. <sighs> I had a crappy childhood. Uh, Al Pacino and, and, uh, is, is apparently going out with the much younger Rose McGowan. Did you know that? Yeah, there's Al Pacino realizing how much younger she is than he is. <laughs> Pacino, Rose McGowan, they've been seen on some dates. What would happen if these two had a child? Let's find out right now. And oh, no! Oh. What's with the Klingon forehead ridge? It's a filing system. Uh, this is an attractive couple. No way around. Colin Farrell's been seen with Elle McPherson. Colin Farrell... L. McPherson, let's find out what would happen if these two got it on. I'm just curious right now. And oh! What? That's crazy looking. Peter Gallagher is Jesus in Godspell. 
That's madness. We have no right to do that. Oh, weird. It's craziness. All right, move on. Paris Hilton. Paris Hilton's apparently been seen with record producer Scott Storch. <laughs> it's about time she found a guy. Um, Paris Hilton and uh, this guy, Scott Storch. It's all over the tabloids. Let's take a look at their child. I'm just curious right now what would happen. And then... <laughs> it's like a bird that got punched out or something. It's... Of course, Kate Moss has gotten into a lot of trouble recently for, she's been caught doing drugs, and we thought, uh, well, what if she and her equally out of control, messed up rock and roll boyfriend, Pete Doherty, had a child together? What would that child look like? Let's just find out right now, I'm curious, and then, oh! <laughs> Well, I gotta bring this up. This is the big couple right now. Ashton Kutcher and Demi Moore got married. That's right. They just got married a couple days ago. Let's find out what would happen if those two had a child. Let's find out right now. I'm curious, and then, huh? What the? Oh, no! <laughs> that was an amazing episode of Punk, by the way. And finally, as you know, it was announced today that Donald Trump, as I mentioned, uh, and his wife, Melania, are expecting their first child together. There he is, charming the world. Let's see what their baby's gonna look like. Let's find out right now. I'm just curious and... <laughs> it's gonna be huge. Ladies and gentlemen, we have an amazing show tonight. Uh, stick around when we come back. Martha Stewart is going to be here.